Good morning, my phoenix. Rise and shine. I don't know what's going on with my camera. Um, there's been a lot of issues with the sound. So this morning, I will be doing a regular video and uploading it for you guys. I hope everybody's happy, healthy, and well. Today's affirmation is going to be, I am inspired to be my best self. Y'all, I ain't gonna lie. I don't know what I did with my mic. I'm sorry. So I may sound far away. I'm really not. I'm not that far. Um, I have a feeling that someone is okay being themselves. You know, it's a new year. A lot of people, new year, new me. Whoever I'm talking to. They're just inspired to be themselves. They don't feel the need to be someone else at this time. You have grown. You have evolved like the Phoenix. So, with that being said, congrats to stepping into yourself and being the best you possible for you and no one else. I love that. That is a major growth in my eyes. So, definitely loving the vibes, y'all. Loving the vibes. Um, again, <clears throat> New Year. It's been my baby boy's birthday, big one. So I've taken a little bit of time off. I didn't completely leave my family out. So I will begin to upload soon. <laughs> I could say today, but you know, it depends on what God say. So I just want to let you guys know that I'm thinking about you, even though I'm not uploading yet. We will, we will definitely get around to it. And we're definitely going to have our adult time. Because today is Wednesday, y'all. Wednesday is when we all get to it. Happy hump day, my loves. All right, spirit guides and ancestors, show us what we need to know at this time in my Phoenix energy. Can we get an overall energy for today? Y'all. I think I dropped them, but I am going to take these because yesterday there was multiple messages. This is, is it four? It's four again, y'all. Okay. I don't know, y'all. What's going on? <laughs> we have judgment. Okay. The universe is stepping in. You know, you've done some self-evaluating and, you know, something in your life is definitely at a point of reflection. I feel like there's growth. Like I was saying from the beginning, someone has grown into themselves. We have the will of fortune. Was your destined? It's des Things are destined to change when you have the will of fortune and judgment. So it could be you outgrew a situation, you outgrew a frame of mind, but I feel like luck is on your side with the queen of cups. The queen of cups is intuitive, creative, nurturing, definitely water energy. Love it. Um, and we have death. So, yeah, y'all, someone is, your gifts may even be growing, but someone is growing out of something, something may be over. It could be some type of transformation. It's a transition. And that's what I was feeling. Someone has transitioned. They've grown, but they don't feel the need to be like, oh, new year, new me. No, it's a better me. New year is what I'm feeling because of the growth that has been brought forth. I don't know if it was just 2023 um, for myself personally from 2020. My journey all the way through 2023 has helped me grow, not just as an individual, but that's when I stepped into my spiritual journey. So three years on this road, I've always grown up in church. So, you know, someone may be... Um, like I said, changing the frame of mind, how they see things, how they do things, how things are their perception, because the Queen of Cups is definitely intuitive. So someone is now listening to their intuition. You know, there's a kindness. You feel support around you. Maybe you got rid of some energies that were just draining you with the Wheel of Fortune as well in the upright. And that is bringing in luck for you at this time with that death and rebirth. Letting go and releasing of things that no longer serve us. This could be a career. This could be a relationship. This could be family. You know, I don't know. It's going to be different from all of us. 
But, you know, the thing I'm seeing here is <clears throat> major, major transitions. These are all major arcana. Something major is happening in your life at this time. You may have even gone through a financial loss is what I'm hearing. But at this time, it's... It's okay because you're grounded and the universe supports you. Okay. Discipline is our oracle for the day. I can accomplish what I set my mind to do. Okay. So with discipline, you have now moved into a new knowing is what I'm hearing. With this knowing, you are in a space of doing things more in balance is what I'm feeling. You've called judgment on some of the things that were going on in your life. You looked through it. You reflected on it. And you realized that not everything was for your highest good. You let it go. And, that, you know, that's death. So pretty straightforward growth. And I am proud of you guys. I love this for y'all. I love it for me because I know I've grown. So this has been your morning read. I definitely wish you a day as amazing as you are, my phoenix. I wish you health, wealth, prosperity, and abundance always. And until next time, I wish you love.